food tastes nice on its own. Oh. Um, tastes nice when it's home cooked. Ooh. Ah! Oh! 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 Chicken's fine. Tastes nice when mixed with other foods which necessarily don't belong with that food group you've just mixed it with. So let's find out. Now, before I make myself potentially be sick, um, which has happened before, to be fair. Oh my god! <coughs> I'm just here to let you know that I'm still playing the game. You may remember this in the house tour vid Bunny Hops. <coughs> I don't know what that is, but fishing. Yeah, it's a a, 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 a fishing for a bird. I'm just letting you know. In the description, if you click the link, you can get my deck for free. Like, there's loads of decks on the game, different themed ones. Katy Perry, hot or cold? No. Mine is Harry Potter. Hurry! Now, of course, a lot of you already know this, but just to remind you, the code is Joe Bunny Potter. So you get one of the paid decks for free using that promo code. Swipe up. You can't on this, but the link's in the description. If you want to upgrade, any paid gets, paid gets, paid decks, then you can do so for just a pound. I'll use my promo code, Joe Bunny Potter. Especially brilliant for if you've run out of ideas of what to do with the people in your house. So you can download the game with the link in the description. Now, let's put turd on bread. <sighs> so I've got a bit of cracker on the screen there, I don't know why. Bring it by itself. Before we delve into these weird food combinations, 2021, I must tell you, a lot of them I actually do do, and a lot of them I don't don't do, because a lot of you have suggested them on Instagram. There it is. Just, uh... You know what you know what it is, uh, and you've been suggesting food combinations, which is amazing because um, I get to Try different things in life, which is what lockdowns all about lockdown I do eat strange food combinations as it is a lot of you should agree with them to be honest because they're just perfectly normal the first one Is this That probably wasn't the same peanut butter and brown sauce sandwich not like this that would just be silly. Now, all I hear every time I make this, whether it's in TV land or now, all I hear is Lick, that's disgusting. Lick, why do you do that? And I'll tell you for why. Peanut butter and bread, look at that. Now, if you like this, fair enough. If you don't like this already, then this one's not for you. It's a bit dry on the bread, isn't it? So you put it on, and when you eat it, you've got like bread and peanut butter like <laughs> getting stuck in your throat and all that. Like. Now, we're not drowning it in brown sauce, so that would be disgusting. All we're gonna do is this. This is literally, this is 100% what I do. You even out the dots like that. Okay, I may have done that a bit wrong, put one there. Then you spread it around like a sauce. Oh yeah. Moist. I know you're thinking, oh Joe, that's amazing. Slap it together. Moist. The knife has peanut butter on, don't waste it. I love this. I'll, I'll, to prove it, I'll do a big bite. I love it. I took a bit of a big bite there, so I regret that. More brown sauce. There we go. Number one done. Hmm. I'm not disgusted. <coughs> the next one, I'm not gonna lie to you, I am a little... I'm a tad nervous about it, because I saw it on Twitter, and I thought this can't be right. Then I went on to, you know, the Asda website to get my delivery. We'll get your food in. Where's my muffins? And it was a bundle deal on Asda. It's... My beans! Sorry, I started cooking them because I thought I can get this done as the cook. It's Weetabix and beans. <laughs> this is a fruit bowl with no fruit in it. Weetabix, beans. Beans! Can <laughs> you remember him? Beans! Oh, crummy, no! If you're watching Weetabix, get a crumb filtration system. We'll go for two blocks. Okay, the Weetabix is in the bowl, it's a normal thing to do, and now we're gonna see if the beans are all okay. Beans! I always do mine in the hob, everyone, it really gets them going. You don't want to put it on a high temperature. Well, it's better than dry Weetabix, I guess. I'm all right. The next time you see me, I'll be eating beans on Weetabix. Thumbnail.
Beans, beans, good for your heart. The more you eat, the more you don't fart because it's disgusting, so you won't even digest it. There we go. <laughs> This can't be good, Weetabix. My brain is confused. I don't know if I like it or not, I can't. The Weetabix is so dry, but the beans helps it out with the bean juice. I've no idea, I don't, I don't think I like it, but I don't not like it. It's like having beans on toast, but the toast crumbles in your mouth a bit more than normal. I'm gonna give that a five out of five because I've no idea. Forgot to give the peanut butter a rating with brown sauce. I'll give that an eight out of 10. Wow, I got confused. If you put Yorkshire puddings in a sandwich, it tastes like a banana milkshake. Oh! And to prove it, Yorkshire puddings, oven's on. Give it a couple of menges to warm up. I'm gonna get the bread and butter out and we're gonna have a banana milkshake in the form of food. I need to sort my hair out, I need to sort my life out. I think I need to have a diet out, but that's fine. Shkaboom! Hello there. I'm just buttering my bread. And as I do this, can I just remind you that if you haven't seen the house tour video, which was a while ago now, there it is! <laughs> and to give you a little update at the moment, Fert just on the way. There's no change at all. I've hardly been here. I've spent more time in Manchester, but if you want to see the bougie salt and pepper shaker, tie-dye salt and pepper shaker, please like and subscribe if you want to see more of that. I'm going to put the Yorkshire puddings in the oven now, whilst I wait for them. Come with me, and you'll see a world of pure imagination. Do you remember the shoe cupboard right there? So I've bought a flipping shoe stand. I have. So to pass those seven minutes, let's put it up. Let's put you here. Next to me bag for life. This should be simple. This should be simple. Not thongs, face masks. Do you know what? I'm, I'm not gonna make this a DIY bit of the vid, but I'll show you the result now. Right, ignore them. Just some pants which need a bit of sewing in a certain area. I need to stop doing the roly polies. Right then, here they are. Now, before I get into this, I can promise you I am all right. We're just gonna go for two Yorkshire puddings. They're in there. They're hot, there's butter, there's bread. I am all right. And if you hear that crunch, you means, it means you're off to a good start. That's a proper Yorkshire pudding sandwich. And this is gonna taste like a banana milkshake. I mean, it should do when I was little, it did. Mmm. It doesn't. I think it's because I'm using brown bread. Mm. It doesn't taste like a banana milkshake, but I do like it. And for that reason, it's not as good as the peanut butter and brown sauce. I give it a seven out of 10. So it's Yorkshire puddings in bread, baby. Oh, that one's hot. So this is one of my favorites and it's popcorn, which is everywhere and white chocolate buttons. And I'm not kidding. If you haven't had this snack while watching films, or anything, do it. And you don't know what you're gonna get every time, it's a surprise, what's this one? Bit of popcorn, and you can feel around for a bit of a button and popcorn. Oh, oh! And if you don't like white chocolate, put a different type of chocolate in there, you hooligan! This one for watching films or anything has to be a strong 10 out of 10. I might as well do it, 10 out of 10. That's 10 out of 10, that one. This wasn't meant to be a messy video. There's one in my plant. Ah. <laughs> Hasta la vista, popcorn! Now, the most random one, which a lot of you have said, let's see which of you are disgusting. This came up probably the most. The first one, ketchup on a cucumber. Bananas and ketchup, that's you, Kaylin. You're disgusting. Ketchup and ice cream, Jenny, get out of town. Cucumber and peanut butter. All right. Just feels weird. No. No, two out of ten. Two out of ten! There's too much ketchup in there. It's in the cucumber juice for YouTube. Here we go. No! No! Oh, I broke my bin! Oh! No, that's a two out of ten. I don't know why it's not a one out of ten. It's probably because it didn't make me cry. 
Why am I still eating it? Egg in a donut. Got me donuts. In the meanwhile, Easy or Issy 9128 says Nutella and carrots are nice. Move you over there, Izzy. Right, you're on the story. Oh, it is. It is. It actually is. It's weird, but I like it. Seven out of ten. Well, the eggs are b -b boiling, and I'm gonna slap an egg in the middle of a donut and eat it. You can't stop me. No one can. Dramatic music, please, Joe. Thank you. Mm, Joe. This is quite a controversial one, and I put it on like Instagram and Twitter. That's how I'm already burping thinking about it. And it's kicked off because it's an egg on a donut. Look, the heat has melted the chocolate into it, and it looks like. Okay, here we go, everyone. Mmm, it's actually very nice. I'm going in. You're gonna hate me, but I like it. I like it. My brain's telling me that I should feel sick. Oh, God. But I think I like it. I'm confused, though. It's a bit like the Wheaty Bix bean situation again. My brain is confused. Six and a half out of ten. No, seven and a half. Seven and a half out of ten, that. For the boys! This is the worst thing I've ever seen in my life. Delete this. I'm so uncomfy. I hope both sides of your pillow are warm. Ah! I think we'll call it a day then, everyone. I'm just in the room, which is just full of hoodies. We've encountered new tastes in life. But it's you lot, disgusting Molly, peas and spaghetti on wheat urbix. Uh, grass and marmite, 10 out of 10. Esther, you, you're disgusting. What's wrong with you? Emily, butter with broccoli and a little mustard on it. Are you off your rocker? I'll see you next time with another wobbly camera and perhaps some better food. Oh, spaceman. Hope you're doing grand, stay safe, bye. No. We've matured on this channel. Spaceman.